From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your weather tonight. Mostly clear skies and light northerly winds in place for tonight. But because we were hotter up into the low to mid 90s this afternoon and we're starting to introduce a little bit in the way of higher dew points now into the low levels, we're not going to be as comfortable during the overnight, staying in the 70s. I think morning lows are right around 70 for most of us as we head into the daybreak hours of our Saturday morning. And then even hotter conditions as we head through our Saturday and especially our Father's Day on Sunday. Future cast tonight showing mostly clear skies. A few more clouds drifting into our daybreak, but still mostly clear. Morning lows in the lower 70s. Maybe a bit more in the way of cumulus cloud development for our Saturday compared to the last day or two. Still mostly sunny to partly cloudy. Daytime highs into the middle 90s for most of us by the afternoon. Heat index values in the upper 90s to near the triple digits. Falling back into the 70s overnight for a Saturday night. Bottoming out once again right around 70 by daybreak on our Sunday morning. Then a bit more in the way of cloud cover, but still partly cloudy. And a bit more in the way of moisture by the late afternoon and the evening hours of Sunday. So a few isolated thunder showers possible. Scattered thunder showers possible on Monday as well. And then it's a question mark from Tuesday through Friday because we'll have deeper moisture coming northward. However, the deepest part of the moisture may start to shift west of us. So for now... We're going to hold daily low isolated thunder shower chances Tuesday through Friday, around 20% each day. However, we may start scaling that back if this westward trend with the deeper moisture does play out into next week. No big widespread heavy rain chances around the area for at least the next seven days. What we do have on the docket, warm temperatures this weekend. Summer heat definitely here, mid to upper 90s for daytime highs Saturday and especially Sunday on Father's Day. That's when heat index values sneak up into the lower triple digits. We do back that down a little bit early next week and then the ridge flexes its muscle again mid to latter part of the week. So we start warming up once again toward Thursday and next Friday. This weekend, if you're trying to get away from the heat, not going to have too much luck with that. We're going to be attuned to 90s across much of the southeast, whether you're at the beach along the Gulf Shores area, whether you're at Gatlinburg, or if you're staying locally near the rivers and lakes, maybe a thunder shower locally on Sunday, better chance of rain along the Gulf Coast on Sunday. Otherwise, we're partly cloudy each day here. But if you can tolerate the 90s, things won't be too bad for outdoor plans as long as you pay attention to the radar on Sunday. If you're by the pool to beat the heat on Saturday, though, beautiful weather for that and great pool weather into the mid-90s by the afternoon for daytime highs. Mostly sunny, so no dodging thunderstorms on our Saturday here locally. If you're by the pool or the splash pad or playing out with the sprinklers, that type of thing. Mostly sunny, partly cloudy for Saturday. Maybe a few isolated afternoon and evening thunder showers. Father's Day Sunday, hot on Sunday, hot on Saturday too, but even warmer Sunday. Back to seasonable Hot temperatures on Monday with scattered showers and thunderstorms. And then like we talked about, we'll hold it at isolated thunder showers Tuesday through Friday of next week. But we may start to scale those rain chances back a little bit with a deeper moisture starting to trend a little west of the area. We'll be looking at that through the weekend. There's your latest seven-day forecast. Brian Wilson's here with you through the weekend with all your latest local weather.